Hey everyone. So, just to, again, wanted to bring you along. Um, starting more lettuce seeds. So I'll be starting seeds each week um, for the lettuce for four weeks, and then uh, wait until I can harvest the first tote. Okay, so there's a couple reasons actually why I am repeating some of the stuff that I do. Um, um, one is uh, because we do get new subscribers and they won't necessarily go back and look at the videos that we've done before. Um, and the second one is I'm actually doing a chronicle of what I'm doing because half the time I can't remember what I plant. So I have my seeds on the side and these are going to be iceberg heading lettuce. So these four will get the iceberg heading lettuce. So I'm going to go ahead. Um, I soaked the Rockwell cubes. I'm actually going to put a couple little holes on the sides. I'll put two seeds per because I've been getting pretty good germination. Um, and I don't use the center hole when I do multiple seeds. That way the roots kind of stay apart. And generally they will grow straight down. And if I did want to cut them apart like I did the tomatoes, I can. So I just put a couple little holes in the sides and I will put one seed in each hole. I don't know if you can see that seed there. It sticks on the end of it pretty good once you wet it. And I will basically just drop it in the hole. Make sure it stays. Grab another seed. Drop that in there. One per hole, two per cube. Okay. Now these will basically stay in this container. I put them on the side here. And I close this. So that it stays warm in there. Now when I set them under the grow lights here, I have these little grow lights I use for sprouting stuff. So I put those under there. They do let off a little bit of heat. So again, I know I've said it in the past, but this will get off full of humidity. You, you'll see the, the condensation form all over. It helps to keep the rock wool cubes wet until they sprout. And once until they're ready to go in the totes um, which are over there so just wanted to run through that and again after these are ready to go in then I will start another set of seeds and then the same thing so I'll have four sets of seeds going and then I'll wait to see how long it's going to take to harvest the first set before I start a next set all right that's it just wanted to bring you guys along show you what I'm doing showing you the new setup and hopefully it works out well. And again, this will be with Maxi Grow General Hydroponics. All right. So if you like the video, please click the like button. Please subscribe. Leave a comment. And until next time, go out and grow something. See ya.